season of Lent. The season of Lent is a journey that takes us to the celebration of the passion, death, and resurrection of Jesus. Um, when I think about Lent, there are several things that come to my mind. The church suggests fasting and praying and almsgiving. But this Lent, the word sacrifice came to my mind. The ultimate sacrifice, of course, is Jesus offering his life for me so that I may have eternal life. But during my life, I've had the blessing of someone in my life who gave the ultimate sacrifice, my grandmother. My grandmother raised me, a very quiet lady, but she was a model of prayer, of fasting and almsgiving. I remember most vividly, especially her praying. She would come every Sunday faithfully to Mass, every Tuesday for Novena, but every third Sunday, she would take a trip by train down to Our Lady of Lords Parish in Brooklyn for a Novena to the Blessed Mother. And she would take me with her. And that has always stuck in my mind. A very prayerful person. It's from her that I learned faith. Sacrifice. She raised my sister and I, gave up her whole life for us, never once complained, did her thing. She was a very giving person. Every Tuesday, she would make a big pot of homemade soup, every Tuesday. And then every Wednesday, she would walk down pretty far to a disabled friend of hers and give her a pot of soup faithfully every Wednesday. That struck me too. She was also a model to me of forgiveness. Never once did I ever, ever hear her say one unkind word about anyone or to anyone. As I get older, of course, back then, I didn't realize how much of an influence she had on me. But she was truly a model of sacrifice, along with my father. I think that's what Lent is all about. Giving to others, praying, and being a role model for other people in very simple ways, just as Jesus did. Didn't make a big deal, but by giving of himself. And so I pray, Heavenly Father, through the power of the Holy Spirit, give us all the grace to sacrifice ourselves through prayer, through fasting, and through almsgiving. And we ask this through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, amen.